Today, I'm gonna discuss why fruits are good for you. If you Google things about fruits, there's a lot of misconception around it. People believe that it has sugar that's gonna make you fat. Even some doctors and a lot of personal trainers, they actually advise against eating fruits because it's gonna spike your insulin level. They say it's gonna make you fat, but that's not true. You need to understand how humans came about. Homo sapiens, we have been around for maybe 200,000 years. And it's only the past few hundred years that refrigerators, plastic packaging, animal agriculture, modern agriculture as we know it, uh, supermarkets have been made available. So before that, we were pretty much hunter-gatherers. We were cavemen for the majority of these 200,000 years. So if you think about it, what type of food was the most easily accessible for us humans? And the reason why I'm talking about history is because evolution dictates what our bodies are today. So, you know, we came from apes and being able to stand upright has advantages. That's why, you know, we branched out to become our own species eventually. What I'm saying is that if you look at our history, our ancestry, we have thrived and survived off fruits. We were built to eat fruits, especially if you have melanin, dark pigmentation on your skin of you know African descent, the closer you are to African descent, the more your body is actually ready and just you know, just like wanting pure fruits as fuel if you let it. But the problem is that most diets nowadays it has junk food, it has all these stuff that's confusing our digestive system. So sometimes even when something is good for you because what you have inside the microbiome, the digestive enzymes, it's the wrong stuff because you've been putting unhealthy stuff for a long time. It's gonna feel as if healthy things are actually unhealthy for you. So I would actually suggest that instead of doing a very shallow research on Google, asking is fruits good for you or bad for you? Because you have to realize first five pages of Google, most of these articles, most of what you think is science or facts around nutrition, they are backed by industries that funded this research to propagate whatever agenda they have. So the meat industry, the animal industry, you know, all these industries, they are related to the nutrition industry, including the FDA, which is the governing body that determines what is supposed to be healthy or good for you. So instead of just looking at that, I suggest you read books like Sapiens. That's a very modern, easy to read book that gives you a very good bird's eye view of humanity and how we came about today. So aside from that, if fruits make you fat, I would be really fat because I eat about two kilograms of fruit every single day. I'm about to break my 18, 20 hour fast, which I do every single day on fruits. This time it's about one and a half kilo of papaya but that's because uh, some parts were rotten. I had to throw it away. So give it a shot. Do your own research. Do your own independent thinking. Don't just listen to what people say because most people just parrot bullshit that they hear. And I really appreciate you. If you found this video helpful, I would really appreciate if you share it. Uh, if not, that's cool. Thanks for watching.